Hello everyone, this is the Amazing Taco Brothers here, and today I'm going to show you how to make a Minecraft 1.8 bucket server that supports all of the new blocks and mechanics. So, the first thing that you'd want to do is download three things. The Java JDK, Git, and buildtools.jar. To download the JDK, click the link in the description for it and agree to the terms. Find your version of Windows that's either 32-bit or 64-bit, and download that version. Then when the download's done, open the file and install it. To download git, click the other link in the description that says git-scm.com. When you get to that site, click downloads for windows. You should be brought to a page that downloads git. Once you have it downloaded, open it up and install it. Lastly, click the link in the description for buildtools.jar. It should download the newest version. After you've installed both the JDK and Git, create a new folder anywhere on your machine and place the buildtools.jar file inside of it. Now you're going to need a .sh file to run the buildtools.jar. To create one, open up Notepad or Notepad++ and paste the code from the description labeled Code 1. Then save it as a .sh file and make sure it's not saving as a txt file or any other type of file. Also make sure you put it in the server directory. The next thing you need to do is double click on the .sh file to run the build tools file. It'll take anywhere from 10 to 20 minutes or even more to complete the process. What it's doing is downloading all of Bucket and Spigot and compiling them so that you can use it on your server. Once the process of downloading and compiling Bucket has completed, Go ahead and find the craftbucket.jar file in the location that I've put in the description, and then copy it to your server directory. What you're going to need to do now is create a .bat file, and this time use code 2 from the description. Make sure you save it in the same directory as your server files. This is the last step before we get into actually running the server. So now all you have to do is create a new text document, name it eula.txt, and inside the document, type EULA equals true. Now just open up the new .bat file you made, and you should have a working server. To connect to it, under the multiplayer menu in Minecraft, choose Direct Connect. Type localhost, and then join it. For others to join, look up a Hamachi tutorial for Minecraft servers, or a port forwarding tutorial for Minecraft servers. Lastly, I'd like to address one common error. This error is known as cannot find port, and it appears when you are already running the Minecraft server, or something else on your computer is already using that port. What you would need to do for this is try restarting your computer, because what you may have done is opened the craft bucket jar file instead of the .bat file, which can mess things up. So anyways guys, thanks for watching, I hope this helped, and if you have any questions or problems, please leave them in the description and I'll try to help, or maybe someone else in the comments can help you too.